community in Lewiston will gather today to honor and remember Ladrina Cubaloso. Earlier this month, a pregnant Cubaloso was allegedly killed by her boyfriend in a hit and run crash. WMTW News 8's Norm Carcos is live in Lewiston this morning, where her friends will raise awareness for victims of domestic violence. Good morning, Norm. Megan, good morning to you. That's right. Later this morning, uh, friends of Ladrina Cubaloso will gather right here on the corner of Birch and House Streets, which is where we are live here in Lewiston this morning. This is the very spot where she was struck and killed just a few weeks ago. Now, October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month, and her friends want to remind the entire community that Ladrina did not die in vain. They're holding a press conference here at 10 a.m. to honor her, remember her, and to urge the community to stand up against domestic and sexual violence. Now, police have charged her boyfriend, Avaristo Deuce, with murdering the expectant mother. Her unborn child was also killed in that hit-and-run crash as well. Deuce was taken into custody at New York's JFK airport as he was trying to flee to Haiti. The 32-year-old Kubaluso was four months pregnant. Her friends and neighbors say that the two had an odd relationship and that she feared for her life, and some say Ladrina had started to take steps to end that relationship. Well, they say they remember her as someone who touched many lives, tirelessly working to volunteer at the Hope House. Her friends also planning to hold a memorial service for Ladrina later this week on Friday night at 6 p.m. at Kennedy Park. And again, today's press conference begins here in the corner of Howe and Birch later this morning at 10 a.m. Live here in Lewiston, I'm Norm Carcos for WMTW News 8.